there's a there's a phrase in our alma mater that says faithful, loyal, firm, and true. You are certainly all of those, and we miss you in Atlanta, and couldn't be more happy for your induction into the Hall of Fame. Yeah. Congratulations! Congratulations! Congrats. As a, a competitor and a quarterback, I always love it when I'm fortunate enough to have him uh, ref my games because I already I know that um, he is as passionate about about it as, as we are. So it's um, it's refreshing and uh, he makes it um, a lot of fun. Um, you know, he calls a, a fair game. He calls it tight, so I know that I'm going to be protected as a player. Um, and he's also a lot of fun in the field. He he can laugh. He can he can take a joke. He can throw a joke. It's uh, it's always a, a lot of fun. I think Lance uh, deserves to be inducted into the uh, National Hall of Fame because he is a fantastic leader, uh, both on and off the field. I was always impressed with Lance when I met him years ago at national tournaments, and most recently when he joined uh, the Boston League, Lance has really elevated the game of, of our referees, and he is a not only a fantastic referee, but he's also a fantastic teacher. And that this is a person who is one of the most polite, one of the sweetest, one of the nicest people that you could ever meet. meet. But my God, does he know how to be a rat and how to and how to demonstrate that to others? And he is in the last uh, seven or eight years he's been in the league. He's completely turned around the um, officiating and able to be um, a lot more professional, a lot more organized. Lance absolutely allows. Allows all the referees to reach their highest potential as a referee. But okay, this is how it's done. If you want to get better, this is what you got to do. And then they do it. And Lance pushes them to where um, they, they can become even better than what they are or what they think they are. I started out with very little refereeing experience. Just a tiny bit, basically, refereeing kids. Uh, and has mentored me, has mentored countless other officials and really brought us into the game and deepened our understanding of the game and our skills, which is I'm very, very grateful for and I know a lot of people are very grateful for. Um, I know for myself I was always uh, too timid to white hat and, um, and Lance uh, for a couple, of, a couple of seasons was okay with that and then about season four or five um, put the white hat on my head and said, and threw me out there and said, "You got this." And because of the the ways, because of, of his teaching and all that mentoring that he did with me, I, I actually was okay and am okay uh, white hatting now um, because he he takes that approach of wanting to be uh, a leader and wanting to be a teacher and, and does a very excellent job at it. Um, I think it says something about this league that we value referees. Um, and we value what um, a good referee brings to the experience of, of playing flag football um, to, to induct someone um, like Lance into the Hall of Fame. If you know Lance, you know that he's structured, dependable, definitive, and most importantly, fair. All the great qualities of a top-notch referee. Don't forget, he's the cutest. And as Robbie pointed out live, he's the cutest referee as well. But not only is he a fellow referee, but he's a fellow board member. So I get to see his commitment on and off the field. I'm happy to call him my friend and I'm honored to wish him congratulations into the Hall of Fame. Lance, you put up with so much of my yelling at you and arguing with you when I was a player. You continue to put up with so much of my yelling and arguing with you now that I'm also wearing the stripes with you. I think that it's so special that you are the first official to get into the, the Hall of Fame. I think it's so important that they have inducted you into the Hall of Fame, so congratulations. You are so deserving to be here. Uh, Lance, we appreciate you and what you've done for this community that we all love. Uh, you know I adore you. Thank you and congratulations for becoming part of the NGFFL Hall of Fame. Lance, even after all the years of watching you throw this at me, I'm extremely proud and excited for you to join the class of 2015 into the Hall of Fame.